In this video, I'm gonna show how to connect the real link Wi-Fi camera to a real link NVR. So the idea is to have the camera up and running via Wi-Fi and you can see via NVR, via cell phone or via software. Let's connect the camera first to a router or a switch using cable like this one. As you can see, I have the camera connected here via cable and I also have the NVR connecting the LAN port to the same switch. You can use a switch or a router. In my case, I'm using a switch. This is a Netgear and here I connect this Netgear switch to my router, okay? It's a Wi-Fi router, so the camera can also use the antennas to connect to the same router at first, right? But the overall idea is to have camera and NVR connected to the same network and sharing the same IP range. And after that, you can unplug the cable, right? So let's come here with the Real Link app and you come here to this plus signal to add a new camera. Here we go. Then you can scan a QR code. Let me just do this. So here on the bottom of the camera, I have the QR code. I just need to scan with the cell phone. Put the camera back into place and put the cell phone here and it's connecting to the camera. And here I need to create a password. Let me do this. So here we go, create a password, hit next. Then you can give your device a name. So here we go with the camera name, hit next. I'm not, I'm not using this QR code anymore. So let's just click here, finish. And here we go, I should have the camera working now. I'm just click here and see that the camera is working. But right now it's using cable, see? Moving my hand in front of the camera, using cable. And I'm going to disconnect the cable now from the router or switch, in this case a switch. And you just need to wait for a while. The camera is going to disconnect from the cable and it's going to start using the Wi-Fi. Why? Because my cell phone is connected to the Wi-Fi. And then when I set up the camera, it shares the information with the Wi-Fi and password with the camera. So it works like this. Basically, you see here, I just need to click it again. Now it's going to connect via Wi-Fi. So again, it's working and the cable is no longer connected here, right? But they are still on the same network because I have the cable from the NVR to the same switch or router, right? And as you can see, I'm not using those ports from the NVR. I'm using the LAN port to connect to my main network. Now you need to go to the NVR. So here I have my other cameras and I just click here to add a new camera, okay? So it can basically find uh, new cameras here, especially if you click here on auto add, it's going to look for the cameras of the network. As, as you can see, it found the real link Wi-Fi camera too. That's the name I give to my camera. I click here and I need to input the password, right? So the camera IP is already here, port, name, and everything else. I just need to input here the password. So let me do this. So here we go, I have the password, hit okay. Wait for the camera to connect and here we go connect it and work, right? So let me just come back here to the main screen. I can see all the cameras. They're connected here, okay? Let me just close this one. And here we go, double click. And I see my camera connected and live. So working with my NVR, okay? So it's pretty simple. Just remember to connect first the camera using cable. You, of course, you need to power the cam camera as well using the power supply connect to the same switch or same router using cable, you scan the QR code of the camera, so you can add the camera to the cell phone. And remember also to have the cell phone connected to the same network via Wi-Fi, right? The same network that the camera is going to share. So that's the basic idea. You connect via cell phone, and then you unplug the camera and you can connect to the NVR, right? So guys, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments. And I see you in the next one.